Welcome to the first AFC event, Boxing Edition, and it's a friendly, non-official, light contact tournament where hobbyists and amateurs can test their skills and gain new experiences. Let's get ready to rumble! So, now we have a match between Michael and Shinobi. This should be interesting because they're the two guys with the longest reach. Although Michael has a very different style to Shinobi. So Michael and Damien use more of proper boxing methods. Where Alex and Shinobi use more of the long reach Jeet Kundo style punches. As you can see here, yeah, Michael tries to go in and throw a couple of combinations while Shinobi is trying to keep the distance. Good counter there. Another good counter. Yes, Michael put a few good counters in there. And they're looking for the... There we go. Yeah, boxing is like a game of chess where you try to find an opening or wait for your opponent's mistake. Even though you have your strategy, sometimes it's not possible to go the way you want it to go. You have to adjust. Okay, Michael is doing a good job countering with the lead left hook to that. He's done it a few times already. Alright, good. That was a good good connection by Shinobi with the lead hand. Both Shinobi and Alex need to use the rear hand more. Fo they focus way too much on just the lead hand. Okay, Michael goes in for the offensive and he did put in a couple of good punches there. I would give that one to Michael again. Of course, I am not present there so it is hard to know what the judges see and what they call for but I did see it there we go some good counters by Michael that was a good one too he touched and he avoided the counter both of them went in there but yeah with the lead there we go with the left hand Michael did put in some good counter punch there we go again it's kind of an odd overhand jab that he does sometimes. When you have long arms, you can do that. See, Michael does stay with his orthodox stance most of the time, which is a good thing. Switching around too often is not very good. You want to do it when it's the right time. You don't want to switch hands all the time. Good. Now Michael is a little bit more neat. Another good punch to the face. Another good counter over there. Good job. I see that most mostly nobody wants to go into the pocket the very close range exchange of punches and everyone tries to go for the uh, there was a drop but that was not that was just a slip anyway they will try to fight from a longer range the key is in fact knowing how to use the close range fighting when you when you box that's where it gets complicated interesting that rocked him that was a good good punch there so shinobi only uses good good cross there with the rear hand she know i was about to say shinobi uses primer primarily he uses the forward hand the lead hand he did throw a couple of, of good rear hands though and he did rock michael there before knocking him down they're not going full contact here, but some punches will always land a little bit harder. Oh, 
okay Michael was trying to throw in some heavier combinations in the end this one is hard to tell the first round I give it to Michael but the second round I don't know Shinobi did manage to knock him down with some nice punches we'll see we'll see how they go there was a great great punch to the face by Shinobi I think Michael in the end decided he wanted to go further but it didn't quite go let's see yeah Shinobi 